Today, I'm going to share with you what soundproof glass is, how it works, and how to soundproof your windows. I'll also take you through the physics of soundproofing, how STC ratings work, and how to easily order the glass. Hi, I'm Sydney with Two Way Mirrors. Every week we bring you new lessons based on our experience in the glass and mirror manufacturing industry. There are two different applications for soundproofing that make soundproof glass a necessity. In an office environment, maintaining privacy between rooms is critical. We can bind two-way mirrors with regular glass to create soundproof two-way mirrors which are perfect for projects requiring a high level of privacy. Museums and retail stores also use soundproof glass to enhance their ambience by blocking out sounds that would ruin the experience. Is the noise outside driving you crazy? Common sources of noise pollution include traffic sounds, dogs barking, airplanes, mowers, and leaf blowers. If noise is interrupting you constantly, then installing soundproof glass can bring peace and quiet to a noisy room. An STC rating is the sound transmission class rating, which is a way to rate how well an assembly of materials reduces noise and sound. The higher the STC rating, the less noise you'll hear through the glass. Due to the laws of physics, no glass setup can be 100% soundproof, but a very high level of sound can be blocked. That is why there are levels of soundproofing based on glass layers and air spaces between them. Also known as an IGU, most soundproof glass is supplied as an insulated unit with an air gap between the panes of glass. The most popular soundproof glass we sell is made of quarter inch glass on both sides with a half an inch of space held together with a spacer between the two pieces of glass, making it one inch thick overall. This has an STC rating of 35. A rating of 35 means that loud speech is not recognizable through the glass, which is ideal for most applications. STC ratings are laboratory tested between two indoor spaces rather than an indoor space leading to an outdoor one. When you're specifying an outdoor window, you want to look at the OITC rating. OITC stands for Outdoor Indoor Transmission Class. When facing outside, the one inch thick soundproof glass we mentioned before with an STC rating of 35 has an OITC rating of 30. A rating of 30 means that normal conversation is not audible through the glass, but loud speech can be heard through the glass in this case. If you're trying to block out loud noises such as traffic or airplanes flying overhead, it's recommended that your glass have an STC of 43 or more and an OITC of of 36 or more. Now I'm going to take you through the physics of soundproof glass. This is all super interesting, but where do these numbers come from? To understand STC and OITC, you also need to understand frequency, decibels, and transmission loss. Frequencies are measured in hertz. This is a measurement of how many sound waves pass by per second. Human ears are capable of hearing frequencies between 20 hertz all the way to 20,000 hertz. However, this will decline with the person's age. Decibels are the unit that measures how loud a noise is. The average home will have a decibel level somewhere between 40 and 50. This is a comfortable level for our ears. However, if a noise is over 130 decibels, it can cause extreme pain and even damage your eardrums. This measurement is taken by looking at the difference between decibels on either side of a wall. If your roommate is playing guitar at 100 decibels in one room and then closes the door, then there might only be 75 decibels registering. There is now a difference of 25 decibels because of the transmission loss from the door. When you get the STC or OITC rating of a glass, the number is based on the sound intensity loss through a barrier, which is recorded in decibels. This is like the situation we just talked about with transmission loss. The main difference between STC and OITC being the OITC is mainly geared towards low frequency sounds like a train or traffic outside, and STC is more for the high frequencies like a television running or children playing. So to sum all of that up, STC is mainly used to assess barriers within a home, while OITC is to measure street sounds ability to travel indoors. Let's check out some real life applications where soundproof glass is used. Schools are very loud and have long echoey hallways that amplify sound. In schools, soundproof glass is used to help students stay on track. Having the sound barrier helps students stay more focused on their studies and less focused on distractions outside of the classroom. Adding an anti-reflective layer to the glass would help reduce distractions even more. There's no place like home, except when you live right next door to a busy street, fire station, or airport. With soundproof glass, you can cut down on outside noise and get more beauty sleep. We'll help you choose the ideal STC rating before ordering your glass. This is one application where soundproof glass is a must. 
If artists didn't have soundproof glass in their recording studios, outside noises would cause distortion on their recordings. No one wants to hear a train horn on Beyonce's new track or some muddled singing from an artist next door. Having soundproof glass in the studio makes the recordings as clean cut as possible, which makes the editing process even easier. This means songs dropping even faster. If you're looking to purchase soundproof glass and upgrade your home, check out our website, twowaymirrors.com. Ordering soundproof glass is easy. The one inch thickness is the most popular and we have a handy price calculator directly online where you simply plug in your size, hit calculate and add it to the cart. For custom makeups with higher STC ratings, send us a quote request and we'll custom quote it for you. You have the choice between clear glass or a two-way mirror, which enhances privacy. The glass can be cut to custom sizes, so just shoot us an email or give us a call to give us your measurements. We'd love to hear from you. Okay guys, that is all I have for you today on soundproof glass. I hope you found this video helpful. If you have any questions, leave a comment below or shoot us an email. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and hit that subscribe button right now so you can stay tuned with our latest educational content. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Sydney with Two Way Mirrors and I'll catch you guys in my next video. And now a message from our sponsors, us. A lot of you have been asking how I make my videos. Right now, I'm standing in front of a chroma key backdrop, also known as a green screen. By combining this with a teleprompter, I'm able to script all of my lines in advance, adding the visuals later during editing. A teleprompter is a beam splitter mirror that displays my script in front of a camera. Using a teleprompter allows me to thoroughly research detailed scripts in advance and deliver them effortlessly. The magic is in the transparent mirror, which provides tint-free visibility for my camera to record through. Because the notes are in front of my camera lens, I can keep direct eye contact with you. Here's an example of it in action. Hi, I'm Sydney, videographer, glass geek, and anything else I wanna be when using a teleprompter. I made this guide on teleprompting to help you deliver your message quickly and confidently on camera. I'll leave you all the details below on the simple parts you'll need to make a professional teleprompter using our glass. I'll also leave a link to our free voice activated software, which scrolls automatically while you talk.